Hi, this is Ann with SVG Cut File, and today I'm going to show you how to print an SVG file without a Cricut or Silhouette or other cutting machine. And it does involve changing that file type from SVG to something else, but it's really simple, and I'll show you how. All right, let's get started. Now, a lot of programs don't support SVG, so you can't even open an SVG file in a lot of programs to print it. So how can you print your SVG file? First, you need to change it into something that another program can open. And that is basically the secret. So let's go to vector.com, V-E-C-T-R.com. And then I'm going to go ahead and use online. This is a totally free program. We'll go to open file and I'm going to navigate to floral book one, which is my SVG file. And here it is. Now I'm going to export with this little green arrow right here. And now I have a lot of options. I can change this to JPEG or PNG. I recommend a PNG since we have a transparent background. We'll change this to inches just to see how big this is. This is 7.7 .7 by 6.4 and that's perfect. But you can also change the size here if you need to. If you want to use this on the web, that is what the 72 DPI is for. But if you want to print it, you'll want to choose something like 300. And so now all we have to do is download. Now on Chrome, if I download, it'll come right down here to the bottom left. And then I'll choose this little carrot and go with show in finder. Now PNG files are supported in almost every program. Like you could put this in Microsoft Word and it'll print just fine. You can double click on it, bring it up into um, your image viewer, whatever your computer has, and then just go to file print. So PNG files are widely supported. SVG files are not. So you just need to convert it to PNG and that's it. All right. If you like this video and you want to see more videos like this, just hit the subscribe button and the little bell next to it. And you'll be notified every time a new video comes out. All right. I'll see you in the next video. Thank you.